overwhelmed. If they get out, this is insanity. They should get a trade oh, here. Yeah. And that decision from Afro to hang around, try fight that, instead of disappearing through the red smoke, has offered up a four on four. And popping out of Amy. Now, oh, good timing caught for Farley. Gets body running backwards. Exercise will trade. A three on three where Astralis were far. Zips pushed into Temple. And there's a second and third man oh, right around this corner. Dear. Flash blind okay. zip. It's a really nice layup there out of Exercise. Oko to grab that kill. They spot Blame F back here in Donut. And Glaive has actually left main, peeling all the way back to middle oh. to come and join Blame F. Now he's throwing into this one, 1v3. They've they heard know. the footsteps. They know where he is. They get on the bomb. Low oh. players try to block. <laughs> and Joker will lock the round in with a double there. Heat find the pit. B play in Ooh, tow for Heat. They've lost Lucky. Okay. Just kill him. Uh, yeah. Glaive dead over at Ram. That's the bomb tumbling away. And so it's all on config now. Doesn't really have a lot to work with. Nice. Lops the A1S out, but now you need to go die. You've got to die here pretty quickly, config. Moving up the ramp. They don't have to peek him, but they will feel the pressure to do so. I like it. He goes in with the bomb time if they weren't going to try and wreck yeah. him like that he can just force them to kill him by by going for the bomb plant that's right? nice, it's like the yeah. one way to make sure they do it and uh, all in all and a nice round for heat right dealing with these deagles brushing them aside never getting too worried this is a nice little ct start and this time knows he's in the corner he's going to try and scavenge for those rotates that had to be a kill now chances are diminishing joko's getting rushed down he almost pulls nades nice spray from blame but 10 seconds someone needs to part tips looking for fight he lines up a couple but he's all that stands and sticking it will guarantee they rush him down fake out seven seconds and afro closes ak's on the ground it's and a very very slow one for astralis now we said that their T-side oftentimes looks good. Haven't really had these Lurk players finding impact, finding the openers that we often rely on, right? Glaive and Config both getting uh, churned up on their T side and they get five, six rounds. I still feel like that's enough because this is ultimately a very CT sided map and Astralis will be comfortable on that on that favored half. And I think a lot of the question for me in a game like this is yes, he. You know, Ancient's kind of one of these maps where, in terms of actually looking at it, it's hard to contextualize the first half till you get to the yeah. end, of it, right? Yeah, like. Definitely. Because while a 10-0 can be great, even a couple of T-rounds in at the end there suddenly make all the difference. We've seen you know? some unbelievable comebacks on this map. Even if you remember this, the ecstatic Entropic game, this is one of the reasons we call Entropic one of the best teams on this map. It was like 13, I think it was 14-2 down to Entropic. They swap over, they lose pistol, they swap over, and then they win the game. They pull it back with like a flawless 12 round streak yeah. or something. No, so it definitely can happen. Yeah. Um, over here at lane, lucky. He's locked it in with a double. You know, a, a lot of this kind oh. of lurk style play that wanted it. You got it. Pistols are coming in. Heat are going to have to give up the bomb site. The smoke spam, bomb plant denial, perhaps. All of these options are open. Nice spray for Afro gets one. Config trades with a gun, but still winning this round is going to be a tough ask. Zip in a 1v4, just getting run out right now. All these CTs coming through smokes, and exercise is 10 and 0. This is a player we didn't even really talk about in the previous map because it was Joko Farley. Oh, it's nice. Farley's still here. Config. All oh, right, another. that's more like it. These are the little successes that can make all the difference. Even though, oh, I was gonna what say, happened? Even though one man got a kill over <laughs> in cave, it quickly becomes two. Both. Ooh. It's coming out of a bit of a coin flip for Lucky. Will nope. he do it? No. He oh, believes beautiful. it's clear. Beautiful. Config plays the trigger discipline, and we'll tap Lucky out eventually. Farley holding this line, and yeah, there to beautiful. close the door on Heat in that round. It was you know, you put utility into that round. Is this a B-Rush? Config hasn't bought nades. That implies he's going for an early fight. He's getting flashed into the bomb site. Nice pace change for Config. Quick kill, and the flashes are so assaulting. Heat are kept back. Exercise removed, and Lucky smoked off in the cave. He can try and spam a plant. Does some damage to Glaive, but won't finish the job. And Astralis, a pace change to put them on two. Oh! oh. 
done themselves. Config making this play. Look, man, if Config be in here, it means they've got two guys worried about CT. That's a win for Astralis, who now look to make their oh. way up the ramp into the site. Joko hidden in this smoke, trying. I was going to say to deny the bomb, but he's on six points of health, five points of health rather. He's just trying to stay alive. He just wants to survive this journey. And as that smoke fades, now out in the open. Afro ready for the CT wrap, but he's all alone. He's got to get out of there. Farley's even coming hunting. He wants that AWP. Yeah, if you're wondering what Config got up to and what, what his position uh, you know, meant, it actually killed both A rotators who walked in through mid. They wanted to flank Astralis on the lane, and Config shoots them both. He doesn't even go and Config lurks at A's, finding the impact that we're used to seeing this round, right? They actually look to explode in okay. on the back of it with him. This Deagle on body. Oh, oh, it's clean. That's a lovely double up. And he's no taken. Way. A man advantage round for Heat out of the blue. It's the Deagle doing the bulk of the damage. Glaive might have dealt with the man. Over in. Will he stay for the fight and do Astralis trade it? Glaive is low. If he goes in first, it's a freebie, but he's waiting for them to cross pass. Surprise, surprise. Zip shot in the back. And Glaive now has to stick it for CT, but it's a wall bang from the lane. Joko. And so Heat, they never should have won that. They, they only had a couple of guns and they weren't even the things that did the bulk of the damage there. It's an A pop out of Astralis. There's a third okay. man here in Joko oh. on default with a double, but he will get molotov out. Still, he's given Heat a reason to give this round a look in. Afro already in Temple. Lucky eating over in this little CT corner. Will this go unaccounted for? They've heard that orb fire off. They don't know where the second nice. man is. Farley is fed. With the CT peak and Lucky now making a bit of noise, it goes a long way to get the info. Yep. There we go, now he knows. They're both See donut ya. guys. And Astralis are actually moving into this position. They're going to take the bomb away, but everyone else is hunting. Everyone else is trying to just deal with Lucky, keep him boxed in. And so there's that swing from Zip that will seal the deal on the... Config, he got those openers last time. He's going to go back for it again. He won't be alone. Coming from ledge side is playing. Bit of a whiff, but that 10 at range, the rifle will do it justice. And only USPs get picked apart by Astralis. Just Afro. Oh, this T side isn't very, like, exec heavy. Right? It's a lot more about just having these kind of. Oh. Oh. It's a lot more about having, you know, guys go out, kind of seek some fight. Scared of this corner. And Config just nails the headshot. Full B lane here for Lucky and friends as he had this space. Joker getting crashed through, but they're lining up everything, including with their guns out. Blame. Anti-flash. Blame F in the back line, still over at ledge. Farley holding the deep angle. Going to be hard to get past this. Yeah, sneak walking it. That's nice and easy for Farley. Locked in. He is committed. They've got to clear this. So many angles. They will check. Dropping in. Config spamming. Recovers it well, but out of ammo, it's only one. Here's the repeat. Farley is so fast, and he gets two with the bomb at his feet. Farley anymore. Perhaps there's a tap, and it's only exercised in the site not for long. Astralis work out. Someone like Monacy on this yeah. map. A tantalizing prospect. Oh, that's a mo down in middle. The SMGs getting stuck in. You die mid, our plan A. But uh, good luck planting on this map. It's not happening, Joko. Easy pickings for Astralis. Four up and way back through Spawn. Lane again getting crunched by Astralis. And look at them go. They catch everyone with their backs turned. Afro wasn't even watching ramp. Exercise does find the back of Config coming in through Donut. But they push the volley. They beat him to middle. Glaive barely makes it out. 10 health. Rotate running. Joko's here. And it's the double push through A that Astralis didn't expect. Again, this bomb is still very scarily located. As Glaive should hear it run. But he's been spotted oh, getting out from Donut. Him. Yeah, he thinks he's been sneaky. He thinks he's found a gap. You ain't found no gap, Glaive. Shot in the back of the head. Joko having a beautiful round here. Going to start to run up con or up to a donut, rather, and is bested by Zip. Ooh. Bomb plant having to go down safe. Zip walking in, trying to close the distance, oh. and that's clean. Zipnik's bullied by Astralis. No fear on that repush. And now they're lining up an exec, just flashes over the top, zip blinded. There's maybe an entry here that can get out of control, but he doesn't allow it. Farley doubles up, and this is nice and clean on the B site for Astralis. No pistol success. 11 to 8, and you're. Ding. 
Someone's going to step up to the mark to try and deal with him, and it will be Body running them down. This is the bomb on the back of Exercise going to Donut. Oh, oh that's a lovely flick on a config. And what? can't quite follow up. Farley will even drop his teammate in the meantime. Glaive up close. It's a bit of damage dropping the bomb, but he's traded after one. Farley, 41 points of health. They know he was in Temple. That Molly forces a swing out of him. And he's got a reposition. Can't stop the bomb plant. Can't do anything about that. He now trying to deal with this AWP. They're right up in his face. They're right next to him. Farley just not giving them this fight. Body oh. will get no scope and lives to tell the tale. He's the one that got what? away. Out of them. This would be crazy. Oh, yeah. hang on a moment. Oh, careful. This is the AWP. Hang on a moment. The AWP's here. Caught ahead. Lucky. Good for a double. Oh. And Afro's going to help out. So the danger is eliminated. And it should all now just kind of fall into place. Heat are going to tie this up at 11-11. But as I was saying, right, if they can win this in two, this is looking to get even better. Here's with a 2-0 here. Yeah, just to pick up on some of these wins that Astralis have had as well on this map uh, to, to contextualize their, their performances. It all started back on a moment. Comfort gives one over in middle. Still the aggro blame over here. That Molly means they don't need to clear right. Oh. And they're ready for a left side swing. Blame is gone. This was a 5v3. Oh, Heat now walking caves. Zip what? dead over a B-Ramp. Joko will get traded after the first, but Glaive is the low B-Site defender, no. and he's wiped off the slate. It's only Farley. Very far removed from the B-Site. Lucky. It's empty right now. Glaive's tucked in on long. The Joko, so many crossfires, so many angles to clear, and there's the first. Oh man, this is a lovely bit of room. Like getting up B is oh! so hard, and this guy makes it look so easy. Just Farley who burns in the volley down in middle, and he are on in the series, not going his way. Flashes over this A site now. Farley needs oh, to hold no. the line. Blinded, good for oh. the first, makes it a double. That's more like oh. it. Give him the off, and look what he does. Three in the round, and Farley not giving up without a fight. Forget I wow. said a word. Look at him go. He's in with the ace. That's not luck. That is skill. Config sees exercise and deals with him. Farley missed shot. That all rallies off. The Joko moves up through the ramp, but zip from range can pick him apart. Oh, it's a me messy spray. He gets it down. Bomb dropped off as well as Lucky shooting through the bloom of that smoke. Glaive is still here, firing shots with Zip. Bomb plant is going to come in now for Heat, but Astralis have the... No Afro. They're starting to piece together where he is. They're going to peek him close. Oh, Miss shot, and now That's they it. get even closer. Smoke down. Oh. That's a no-scope. They're on the bomb, though. He needs to move up. He needs to get them off of it, and there simply isn't time. Zip, he'll provide the over... Hell shocked. And they've got to play for overtime in this one. No shutting it out now. Fast out mid. Tech 9 is running right. Config not checked. Easy spray down. Three kills. And that is exactly what Astralis needed. Looks like it's all clicking into place, doesn't it? Only one man left. Body's gone. And so Astralis... Config's really got a gap in mid. They're running into B. They're not waiting around. This is a 5 on 5 execute into the B bomb site. No hesitation here for Heat, but maybe there should have been. Glaive has picked one off the mark. Zip follows up. Double kill on the trade. Not a 3v5, though. Not one Zip wants to give up. And this might just be map three. It's one man and Config smoke walks to close no, it out. Oh, yes, Astralis, they're believing all over again. The full 30 rounds is what it takes, but it does mean this series, this torch is carried.